Makerere University sprang out in 1922 during the British colonial administration over Uganda as a humble technical college that later was transformed into a fully-fledged university, being the most prestigious university in eastern Central Africa, Africa, south of the Sahara and north of the Limpopo, with its first significant administration block being today's defunct ivory tower, or what you call the iconic building. The European architecture self speaking pompous facility became the face and the definition of the university over time, a great inspiration of Baobab over higher education in Africa at large. The facility that housed most of the essential university offices, including the office of the vice chancellor, mesmerized Ugandans and Makere University alumni when it caught fire on the 20th of September 2020. A very big question rounding over Ugandan brains what the cause of the fire could have been. I think this is the worst disaster we have had in our entire 100 year history. We were called just after midnight that there was a fire. I ran here, the fire had started from uh, the right wing of the building, that iconic historic building. It is known all over the world. And it is our responsibility to restore it the way it was. That is going to be our major task now because also, as you are aware, we are celebrating 100 years in just slightly more than a year and we don't want to celebrate when we have got such an accident so our efforts are go going to be geared towards restoring the building as fast as possible we are confident that uh, we have not lost too many documents of course documents have been lost great, great and mighty, the walls are The formerly prestigious and value attracting Makerere University facility remains abandoned on the compound, with its compound being the best grazing points for animals. The university's facility remains seated on the 2020 ashes without any serious attention, like a bush grave in the countryside. As the facility moves closer to its first debacle anniversary on the 20th of September 2021, the hibernated status of the Makerere University administration and the Guild Council about the plight and the restoration of the university's mega facility keeps away hope from the Makereleans and the fanatics of the university who had expected a faster restoration as promised by Professor Barnabas Nawangwe on the day the facility got burned. I, I want to start by quoting the words of Professor Barnabas Nawangwe. He did say it's going to do all it takes to ensure that Makere University's iconic building is restored to its normal status within the shortest time possible. But I can tell you, nearly a year down the road, nothing has been done. The, the, the building remains languishing in devastation up to this date. And we are just close to the 100 year celebration, which he talked about. Nothing has been done. Uh, Mr. President, Your Excellency Ivan Sempija, we need to see you on board mounting pressure on the administration. And Professor Barnabas, our beloved Vice Chancellor, we need this inspirational building back on its normal status. This building is a big thing in nurturing Uganda's education sector. And we, the Makerelians, that is our identity and our face. In fact, that is Makerele. The building is Makerele. Oh, oh, voices singing. 